Here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, after a warm day, still holding on to you know, relatively mild temperatures at this uh, late hour in the upper 50s to lower 60s. But noticeable cool down is on the way for the weekend. It's, it's back to autumn after reaching about 74 degrees this afternoon. Skies are clear in Providence, looking good in Newport as well. And uh, good visibility and uh, dry sky. So uh, no weather issues as far as storms. Looking at uh, 54 right now in Smithfield, 61 in Providence. Most areas have dropped through the 50s. And, and these numbers are significantly cooler than this time last night. So that trend of cooler air starting to work. And you'll certainly notice it waking up early tomorrow morning. But still relatively mild and dry compared to some of the cooler nights that are ahead. And the temperature is getting back to uh, normal, seasonable levels both Saturday and Sunday. Weather pattern change kicking in. Next week is vastly different than what we had this week or even the week before. For one, it's cooler. It's an unsettled weather pattern with several chances for some rain coming up next week. In fact, even as early as late, late uh, Sunday night, uh, some showers coming in. Though Sunday day actually looks pretty nice. So we take a look at the average high temp for this time of year, 62 degrees. And notice we're pretty much in the ballpark in that range most of the time period, Saturday through Friday of next week. The only one day where the temperature spikes up briefly would be on Monday afternoon in the upper 60s. So getting into a pattern that's more like late October in terms of temperature. We have showers offshore that will stay away. Meanwhile, out to our west, not much going on as far as organized precipitation. With that said, I uh, wouldn't rule out a, an isolated sprinkle or shower Saturday afternoon, but I wouldn't alter any plans. The vast majority of tomorrow is actually cool and dry. And you can see the shades of blue across the Great Lakes and the upper Midwest, and this is some of the cooler air that will be filtering in overnight and into uh, the weekend. We take a look at the forecast over the next uh, several days. I want to draw your attention to what's coming out of the Colorado Rockies. You see this system moving across the middle of the country. Now, this is Sunday uh, morning at around 8 a.m. Our weather is fine. We've got a decent day, but watch this precipitation uh, rapidly race off to the east. It's arriving here by around 11 o'clock Sunday night. So Sunday day is real nice, but the strip of rain arriving Sunday night, and this whole system will move into our area for Monday and Tuesday, especially on Tuesday with a widespread rain. But we'll backtrack to this evening and overnight, which is generally just partly cloudy. 7 o'clock tomorrow morning, it is noticeably cooler than where we were earlier this morning. And then during the afternoon, I mean, we're going back and forth between periods of clouds and sunshine, but otherwise a decent day. It's in the upper 50s to low 60s. By 5, 6 o'clock in the evening, we're dropping back into the upper 50s. And then later tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, some extra clouds streaming in and seasonably cool in the upper 40s. So for tomorrow morning, waking up to about 48, 49 degrees at 7 a.m., 11 o'clock in the morning in the upper 50s. And Again, back and forth between clouds and sunshine, some extra clouds mid to late afternoon, but a decent day to get outdoors. Temperatures in the lower 60s. Bay forecast with unlimited visibility on a northwest breeze coming in at about 5 to 10. Seven day forecast. Not bad for Sunday. The weather looks good for the Patriots game as well. And look at that unsettled stretch of weather next week. Cool temperatures and several chances for precipitation. The first being Monday morning and another one on Tuesday. Highs generally in the 60s. Weekend's not bad. It's just uh, you know, feeling more like October. What are you dressing up as on Halloween? <laughs> I'm, I'm not quite sure. I just I haven't put a lot of thought into it yet. Like chief meteorologist, you're gonna go out like that? I'll go. Why not? You yes. could be like a bolt of lightning, <laughs> or like at least get kind of. Well, uh, maybe a, a thunderstorm. Sure. <laughs> All right, check this out, Anthony. A dogoween costume contest in Peru. <laughs> you're not gonna do this. <laughs> First, second, and third Pikachu! places.